Dave McGlashan with the Queen Anne's County Department of Public Works. I'm here today um, on the east side of Safety Drive here at a solar array project that the county has uh, partnered with Solar City in. Solar City is a clean energy company. We have, have entered into a 20 year lease, with Solar City, roughly a 20 acre county owned property. And um, I'm here with Matt Gitt, who is the project manager from Solar City. Matt, thanks for being with us today. Uh, Matt, what Maybe you can just first explain uh, what is a solar array. You've got an array of the solar modules which when sunlight strikes them actually produce electricity. So what we do is install uh, many, many panels and we wire them together uh, kind of like a car battery in series so that at the end you have a high potential that you can then send to central converting units, uh, inverters that convert this raw DC power, uh, which is what I call dumb power, uh, it just kind of shoots into them and then the inverters which are the brains of the system take that raw power and they convert it into uh, grid quality power so it interfaces directly with the electrical grid with the utility uh, and it actually pushes power back onto that grid at a quality equal to their their power taking uh, the infinitely renewable sun okay. and it's uh, converting it into usable electricity Great, great. Well, like I said, we were, we were with a 20-year lease with Solar City, and uh, we're slated to save roughly around $230,000 annually over the 20-year lease. That equates to roughly $4.6 million. This array field will fully power five of the county facilities, as well as uh, a partial portion of the Kent Island uh, wastewater uh, site. Of course, these are estimated. Things will change throughout the year slightly uh, as far as the amount of energy produced. If uh, and somebody wants to find out more information um, on this project, you know, please go to the county website, www.qac.org. And Matt, if somebody wants to find out more about Solar City, where would they, where would they go? Sure, you can visit uh, www.solarcity.com. Matt, thank you for taking the time today and answering some questions for us. My pleasure.